So I am allowing him. I am allowing him to preach. If he tells me to read the Quran in Arabic, I will read the Quran in Arabic. However. I am telling him Muhammad to preach the gospel. Preach the gospel. So you're in okay Greek. with a man mouth Preach the Bible. gospel in Greek. Go. We don't preach need the gospel. To. I don't in Greek. You don't, don't need to. Oh. Uh -huh. I'm not a Muslim. So ask Jesus me to read the Quran in Arabic. I can read the Quran in his revealed language of Arabic. They believe Jesus has been eternally generated from the Father. Do you believe in the eternal generation doctrine? Do you believe it? Oh, the, he slept with this and this happened. Look, 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 look. look. Behave yourself. Behave yourself. It's Let's okay. be adults. Any Muslim can Let's be yourself. adults. I can come to you. Oh, girl. smash infants on rocks. It says it in your Bible. Woman, you is it okay to smash That's infants' right. heads on rocks? Is it okay to smash the heads of infants on rocks? Is it okay to kill them and to smash them? What's worse? What's worse? Smashing the heads on rocks or having sex? So Zishan, what's worse? Killing and smashing or sex? As your prophet Which did. is worse okay. according to you? You can't answer. Day, you you don't want to answer. From the topic of the you will never answer. You, hate your yeah, you can't you answer. Your you you cannot you answer. You, you, you can't read your own Bible in Greek. You cannot defend your Bible. Your Bible tells you to kill babies and infants. He's and now, oh, you had sex with I a nine-year-old. About his prophet. Do you defend the killing of children? One, of babies. First Samuel, chapter 15, verse 2, verse 3. Go, defend your Bible. Go, go, come on. You can take First sex Samuel, come on! on. Verse because you are a clown. Of the Quran. You are a clown. Okay. Not a clown. You two are. How many people do you two bring to Christianity the way you two behave? Trust me. Really? I don't bring really? Christianity. Really? 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 Yes, really? I've seen no one here come to Christianity because of you. That's a very, good point. No a very good point. No one. No one. Very good point. No one. No one. No one comes to Christianity because of you two. Do you want to deal with the question or are you? Do you want to deal with my question? Do you want to deal with my question, or am I just here to be interrogated uh, by you? Next. And I asked you multiple Next questions. Question. Next question. I responded. I will Next respond, question. and it's easy. However, yes. if you're you going to come Next and you're going to interrupt this question, behold, behold, behold right you cannot right. come this question. Yeah, so but I want to start with doctrine, okay, because no, no, doctrine is more important. Absolutely. Do you accept all of the hadith? Can you believe it? Can you believe it? Next question. There's no criteria in which question. you say all of the hadith is sahih according to every single scholar. So according to the sahih hadith, you think, in your opinion, I said, do you accept all the sahih? Really? Really? Okay. We'll see. We'll see when Jesus comes back. I haven't finished okay. my answer. How can I be accused of this? Do you want a wager on it? Do you want a wager? Do you want a wager? You sure you don't want a wager? Please let me finish. Why? Tell me Why don't you want to tell me if I'm right or wrong? Do you accept sahih hadith? I think you're incapable. Do you want to answer? You, you asked me to answer. answer I was infidel. answering, answer but yet you cut me in the middle and reason. you're telling me. You're not interested in answering. You're not interested. Give me a reason. No, you're not interested. Okay, I was so you're answer. saying more. We'll see anyway when Jesus comes back. But why did you interrupt we'll me in the middle of the answer? Okay. Can you, can you ask I'm answer? telling you, I'm telling you, not every no, scholar will accept no. so you every know, hadith no, that's no, sahih no, as sahih. No, no, so for you, you to say, you oh, know, do you accept all of the sahih hadith? Some hadith will be characterized as sahih, but other scholars won't accept it as sahih. You're aware of that, isn't it? What scholars, what aqidah do you affirm? That's got nothing to do with aqidah, whether you accept the hadith as sahih or not. This is, frankly, 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 I'm speaking to somebody who can't tell well, the difference between fiqh difference and hadith. Hanbali What's and the difference Sufi? between fiqh and hadith gradations? Go. Called? Schools of teaching or schools of fiqh are gradations of half of the tafsir and hadith. That's pathetic. Okay. Yeah, how long have you been Salaam. coming to Speaker's Corner? How long, have you, been to speaker's corner? how long Absolutely. have you been coming to Speaker's Corner? I'm alive. How long have you been coming to Speaker's Corner? You don't know the difference between fiqh and hadith. You don't know the difference between fiqh and hadith. 
First, so learn the difference. Question. First, learn the difference between the question, and hadith, and, and then we can have a conversation. If you can tell me the difference, if you can learn the difference between fiqh and hadith, then we can have. You're asking me questions. You're asking me questions. You're asking me questions, but the answer, but the answer, you don't understand. You don't understand the answer. 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 You don't you understand that. Why are you still talking? How can I deal with the you dogmas when you're coming really with oh, really your prophet really married a nine-year-old? And you're really you really you're 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 you didn't even talk about it. And then you ask me a question. You tell me to calm down. I'm a stupid one. Let's talk about that. You told me, look, I listen to you. You told me, look, I listen to you. Why you want to? Can you? Why you want to go and just let's talk smart. about Trinitarian I'm trying to respond to you. Smart. Okay, so You're ask the question you asked yeah, earlier you. about Man. Trinitarian No, I'll, I'll ask you whatever I want. So, smart, like like you. so you're just going to ask me anything? Yeah, yeah. Yes. Well, yeah, you're really scared. You're really scared. So, so I have to ask you. So I have to ask you. I have to ask you. You might want to calm down. I have to ask you. You're really scared. What you want me to ask you? Is this is this the first time we're having a conversation? Shivering in my boots. Your first question. You're scared, boy. Look at you. You're scared, little son. Listen, we Scared you, mate. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. This, ladies and gentlemen, this is the wait, 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 wait. This is the faith Muhammad Hijab wanna be. The only way, the only way, the only way Muhammad Hijab wanna be. Why are you copying Muhammad Hijab? Why are you copying Muhammad Hijab? Why do you copy Muhammad Hijab? Why are you copying? Why are you copying Muhammad Hijab? You're so strange. You're crazy. You're crazy. Hey, you're a joker. You you're 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 Why are you copying my other job? You're creating your own persona. Why are you cooking? Why are you? Why are you? Tonight, <laughs> you. <laughs> That's a joke. You. It's That's crazy. You 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 you're crazy. William Lane Craig compared Trinity to a three headed dog. And your head. What the hell is this? You're a joker. You're a clown. Who said I was William Lane Craig? You know when you're when you're copying Muhammad Hijab, when you have to copy a Muslim, you're pathetic. You guys, you guys have nothing. You guys have nothing. You have nothing. You have nothing. Oh, you're shivering, boy. Oh, look at me. Oh, copying Muhammad Hijab. Christians have nothing, even when they're trying to be ironic, even when they're trying to be clever, they're copying our people. This is what it is. How many followers do you have? How many followers do you have? You've been coming to Rika's Corner. How many? Oh, I'll go there. I'll go there all day. I don't do that kinky stuff. All day. I'm sorry, I've got a wife. Who's your wife? Amy. Amy, your wife. No, no, no. He doesn't want to talk Amy about your wife? dogmatic. Yeah, yeah, hold on, hold on. Is Amy your wife? That's none of your business. What do you oh. want to know about my wife? Why are you telling me you're married? Give me your wife's number. Why are you telling me you're married then? Give me your wife's number. Give me, huh? Exactly. Is you want to tell me your wife's number? Is, is this what your Bible teaches you? Is this what your Quran is teaches you? No, if my Quran doesn't teach me that. I can take sex slaves. My Quran does not teach me that. The Quran says I can take sex slaves. The Quran says I can take sex slaves. You disgusting human being. You sick human being. You're a Disgrace to Christianity. Christians, you are free from this joker and a clown. This Muhammad Hijab wannabe. What a joker. Yes, you're finished, boy. You're finished, boy. This guy. They're trying to. They're trying to. They're trying to copy Muhammad Hijab. It's literally rape. Right. But they don't want to answer the rape in their Quran and their hadith. Do they need to know their own books? They don't. Why would you have he didn't want to. He girl? didn't want to debate would, doctrine. Okay he's, he's running away. Right. When we debate would with somebody, okay we about talk about God. Girl? They jump. Oh, sex with Why nine-year-old girl. Over it. Over it. Over it. I asked him about First Samuel chapter 15 verse 3. Where's Abdul Karim? He's so tough, man. I asked him. I asked him. First Samuel chapter 15 verse 2 verse 3. So and tough, he didn't want to yeah, answer no. wow. where the Bible is no. saying hey.
kill babies, then I give him another reference. I give him another. He doesn't want to talk about that. What does he want to talk about? Having sex with little kids. Yeah, that's what he wants to talk about. Guys, pathetic. He's running away from basic Bible verses. Basic Bible verses. Trying to copy Muhammad Hijab. He has no personality of his own. He has no personality of his own. Allah predestined murder in Palestine. Allah predestined murder in Palestine. I've got a better person than you. Why are you copying Muhammad Hijab? Why are you copying Muhammad Hijab? So cringe. I smashed you in a debate. Oh, yeah. 100,000 people, oh, sorry. Go back home. Go back home. Yeah. You shouldn't, you shouldn't have left your mum's basement. When did I say I was yeah, 100,000 views. You got battered when did I say? in front of everybody. You want to round two? When then get in the queue. When did I say Amy, I came. You. Amy came. Amy came. She ran away. She needed help from her boyfriend. Yeah, the boyfriend came. Now the boyfriend's boyfriend needs help now. Okay. Oh, now Amy wants to come back. Jew. Come back. You know, like the one, you know, like the one pound fish guy says, okay Come on, ladies. Come on, ladies. One pound fish. Come on, ladies. Come on, ladies. One pound fish. I'll have enough. One pound fish. What do you mean scared? She needed you to back her up. She, didn't need she needed you to back her up. And then you need him to back you up. You're scared. Mama Dijab copies. You're scared. Stop projecting her. Ha 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 you are not projecting, asking for my wife's yeah. number. You ask for your wife's name. Yeah, I ask for your wife's, you yeah, wife's, for your wife's name. Exactly. Therefore, you can ask you're my nothing. wife's number. You don't need to have How wife's stupid name. are you? You're, you're equating a wife's you're name you're with a wife's clown. number. Oh, you think a wife's name is equated with a wife's number? Hello. Yes, yes, hello. So here's what happens. I ask his wife's name, and then he goes, let me ask your wife's number. And he says, oh, because I asked, because you asked me your wife's name. Then with this Muhammad Hijab territory, oh, you want to be more famous? You got smashed. Sorry. You got smashed once already. Get in the line. Get in the queue. We're in England. Yeah, get in the queue. Don't worry. Don't worry. There's plenty of me to go around. There's plenty of people. There's plenty of me to go around. He can so film angry. whoever he wants. So angry. He can film whoever he wants. He can film whoever he wants. Why is your friend asking for my wife's number? Why is your boyfriend asking for my wife's number? Why is your boyfriend asking for my wife's number? Is that annoying? Of course he's tough. Look at the size of him. Look at the size of him. Yeah, he's tough. Of course he's tough. Of course he is. Do you, Do you want to bring Amy back? Or you guys, are you, are you guys just going to side her out? This is why the Bible teaches, where in the Bible it says women aren't allowed to talk. Shave the head of the women. Is Amy wearing a wig? Is she wearing a wig? Can we talk about how tough it is? I want to talk about Get in the queue. Get in the queue. You got smashed. You got battered. Oh, you want to come back in now? Yeah. Yeah, we got smashed before. Oh, could I have your wife's number? Uh, because you asked for my wife's name. Uh, is that Christian logic? Is that your Christian logic? You pathetic. The joker. Oh, I'm scared. Scared. No, you don't uh, like why am I standing no. here? No, How do you think I'm running if I'm standing right here? How do you think I'm running? How do you think I'm running when I'm standing here, boy?
to him. I'm still okay. here. Let's have a polite okay. conversation. I'm still here. Let's have a polite conversation. And I will be here, no, inshallah. Hey, there we go. I will there remain there, there, inshallah. He's a child. There we go. He's a little boy. Okay. okay. So are you scared? You guys have nothing. I'm so tiny. Are you scared? I'm so tiny. You don't want to. You're not worthy. You're not worthy. I gave you a chance. I gave you a chance. I gave you a chance. You squandered the chance. You squandered the chance. Yeah, you could have got more subscribers on your unknown channel. You would have got more subscribers on your unknown dead channel. You've been coming to Speaker's Corner. You don't know the difference between Akida and Fit. You can't defend first Samuel chapter 15 verse 3. You have nothing. 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 After three. One, two, three. Allahu Akbar. 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 Allah Akbar. Allah Akbar. That's it. That's it. That's it. Very simple. Very simple. What's going on, bro? Why are you looking? 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 Conclusion is Christians have nothing to offer. That's the conclusion. <laughs> That's, that's the conclusion. <laughs> they say why we should not engage with the conversation, they will be finished like this. No, you know, this is the only way they engage. There was somebody on the side, there was somebody there who we were having a good conversation with, but what he was doing was he allowed a heckler to come in. Thereafter, when the heckler came in, then the others came in. And then the gentleman is here as well. Yeah. And you've so, not been able to defend so, your own so I'll say this now you can say what, that you can say we started like. I will, I will, we started this conversation, and it was an a it was a polite conversation. Then he hold allowed on, Amy on. he allowed Amy to come in, disrupt the conversation, and he stood on the side like a chump. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, I can't control this. I can't the do this. Then, then yeah. Then, then it the was. Then Amy came in. Then Amy came in. Then Amy brought Captain Bloodfire in. Then Captain Bloodfire brought another guy in. Yeah, so he was the wedge that kept the door open. He had nothing. When he, when our discussion, when he was, I asked him, can you justify collective punishment in Palestine? He started thinking, oh, ah, he, who, me in my naivety, in my naivety, I allowed him, mm. yeah, to speak, he said he's naive. yeah. Then Amy came in. Mm. Oh, sorry, I can't control her. Yeah, it oh, is, God. it is Speaker's Corner, and you know what? Oh, you know what? I know her, and this, and, and then her boyfriend came in. Then his boyfriend came in. Then it turned into a circus. Mm. Now that they've gone, now he's turned back up again. Yeah, he is now turned back up again after disrupting a very good conversation. But he was an ins insincere individual, yeah? And those, those individuals, we haven't entertained them. And we don't entertain them because they have nothing. They have nothing to offer. We want to speak doctrine, they come with insults. You give me one Muslim that comes to Speaker's Corner. You give me one Muslim that comes to Speaker's Corner. That Muslim that insults Jesus, that insults Jesus. You tell me one Muslim that has insulted Jesus' speaker's corner. Now if I ask you, which Christian insults the Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him? So many of them, so many of them. If you want to speak doctrine, I believe Jesus, I believe in Jesus. Let's speak about the filioque doctrine. Let's speak about the eternal genera uh, generation doctrine. Yeah, let's speak about the canon. Yeah, the New Testament canon. 
Don't come up to me with these dead arguments that you already know the answer to, that have been spoken again and again just to get clicks and views. I'm bored of this. I'm bored of this. If you want to have a good conversation, we can. On doctrine. You want to be a coward, you can't tell I'm your own coward. friend. I'm you coward. can't even tell your friend to shut up. You can't tell your own friend to shut up when she's when she's disrupting. You're so much of a simp that you can't even tell her to be quiet. Then you know what? I'm not interested. I'm not interested in such a weak man like you that you can't even and you're coming here and telling me, oh Israel, oh so I ask you collective punishment. Is collective punishment okay on Palestinians? He goes, oh, ooh, oh, you know what? Maybe in some situations, you know what? People like that, people like that, their IQ minus levels, minus levels, yeah, not positive. Maybe minus two, minus three. Maybe there's a marble rolling around in their head. That's the only thing that it could be, yeah. And that was one example where they managed to squirm their way in. But, like I always say, you want to speak doctrine, we speak. You want to speak Bible, we speak. We will speak. The sun will go down, the moon will come up. We will speak. We will speak until Allah wills. But if you come here, oh, this is Prophet, marry a nine-year-old, shut up. Shut your mouth. Yeah? Come, come correct. Numbers 31, 18, I could do the same to you. But it's weak. It's pathetic. It's low. Yeah, he's on the sideline like a sideman. They're waffling on the side. Yeah, that's all these people could do. And that's the reality, guys. You want to speak about the Bible canon? Marhaba. I'm ready. If you don't, then shut your mouth with all due respect. Where's my water?